So the NBA's second All-Star game in New Orleans in the past six years turned out to be history-making. A 163-155 final combining for the most points in NBA's All-Star game history, plus the 163 by the East, also a record setter. Kyrie Irving led the way with 31 points for the East, most of those coming in the second half. He's your MVP, but the fan favorite here in New Orleans, of course, Anthony Davis. The Pelicans forward gets his first All-Star appearance, and he made an impact right away. Finished with 10 points in just 10 minutes played. Fun experience. You know, probably one of the funnest times I had in my life. Um, go out there and play. You know, get the crowd into it. Uh, saw some great dunks. You know, some great guys go to work. You know, uh, that's all you can ask for. What's your take on the uh, local favorite, Anthony Davis, running the floor tonight? Oh, I thought he did good for his first All-Star game. You know, uh, his first shot was a jump shot. He hit that. Then uh, him and Chris Paul made a little connection, had a couple of lobs, ran the floor well. I thought he had a pretty good game. What was your take here in your second All-Star appearance here in, in New Orleans? Oh, man, the city is great. You know, uh, we're happy to come back here in New Orleans. Uh, it's crazy this weekend, people everywhere. Uh, but we had a lot of fun. Anthony, what will stand out about this first All-Star experience for you? Uh, that was here in New Orleans. You know, um, a, a lot of you know, fans behind me supporting me. You know, um, so that's, that's probably the uh, biggest memory I will have. You're going to look at that final score and say, was there any defense played at all? Anthony Davis says, in fact, there was, but it didn't start until about four minutes left in the game. That will do it for now. From the Smoothie King Center in New Orleans, Eric Ritchie for CST.